job never ends. Tons of records. Signed by the band. Let's go deliver these. It's just like printing money, man. <laughs> Records. Get them while they're hot. And then Leviathan signed a 60. That's a must deal. Ah, uh, what's been going on with Primus? Uh, man, this is probably one of the chillest tours we've ever done. So, I don't know. We've uh, we've had a lot of like, uh, you know, kind of old man moments where we just like go out to dinner together and uh, tell fishing stories and old tour stories and. It's pretty pretty uh, relaxed. It's very nice. I like it. My kids came out. They've never actually come out for more than like a day or two. But because it's summertime and they're out of school, they jumped on the tour bus um, in uh, New England with my wife. And we cruised around and hung out for about four or five days. My wife left. The kids stuck around, so it was like uh, Camp Mastodon for... Hey, what are you guys doing? What's going on? Oh, we're just talking you? about you, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Spinal Tap, part two. <laughs> this place is like really confusing. It's really hard to get around in here. We need arrows. Never underestimate the power of an arrow. <laughs> Me and my arrow. Me and my bent arrows. Conan's 11 and Harrison's about to be 14. And they're big fishermen. And I was like, you don't know who this guy is. He's uh, Les Claypool. He's like really into fishing, writing songs about fishing, eating fish, you know, everything fish. He enjoys it. I like that my kids have fished with uh, Les Claypool from Primus, pretty neat. <laughs> One of my favorite bands. Touring for nine weeks, I mean, uh, that's why we only tour for like a month at a time because after a month you start to hit the breaking point. You hit, you hit the wall. This tour has been special just because the, uh, the, the whole vibe of Primus and their, you know, and, and our crew, everyone's been really chill and got along great and um, really bonded. So I hope it's something we can do again sometime. So after this tour is over with, I'm gonna go back to my regular everyday life, I guess. Um, I'm always into something, you know. I, I, it's hard for me to just go home and relax and just not do anything, you know. Always trying to r run our web store and, you know, I'll probably within the week have maybe a couple of new songs written. You know, I like to go get right back into like playing my guitar. Like I can't go a day without playing guitar. So I'll probably rest for a day and then uh, just get back to work. I gotta clean my gutters. I gotta do like, you know, normal shit that people do. I mean, there's a, we have a crew, there's like 14 of us out here on the road just with Mastodon, you know. Everybody's got techs and there's, you know, people rely on us for jobs and, you know, we, we rely on going out on tour to try to make some money to pay the bills back home. And, and for us, it's never been an overnight thing. We've started in a van, just the four of us driving around uh, the East Coast just trying to get in and get into the scene, start playing gigs, you know, and not getting paid at all for many years. You know, that's just how you do it. People always ask me, what's the secret to, uh, to being successful? It's, there's no secret, you just do it. You just keep doing it until you're successful at it, I guess. But until you get Grammy, I guess, I don't know, then you, then you can just throw it all in the garbage and, and quit. No, that, that just means you gotta keep working. You gotta keep working harder because now people expect more out of you. They're like, oh, who's this band that won a Grammy? Oh, they're, they're hanging it up. No, no, you gotta keep going, you know. It's, and every day that I can uh, wake up and there's a, another tour on the table, it's like, okay, cool. Because you have to, I mean, you gotta support yourself and support your family. It is work and it's a lot of sitting around doing, doing not a lot, but signing records and doing meet and greets. And I do guitar lessons and I try to keep myself from going crazy out here. So I try to write as much music as possible. It's been real. It's been a great tour. I told the Primus guys earlier, you know, it's been probably one of the, the best tours we've done, most fun, uh, reaching the most people, the biggest tour. And um, I'd love to do it again. And I'm gonna go get ready for my gig and do a little warm up and have some dinner and kiss my wife and uh, 
get out on stage and, and rock your fucking face off.